So Heather, let's start with you. Tell me what you learned at the workshop in Atlanta. So everyone had a role there and just all the different things that we learned is like super amazing to applying to actual life. You know, it's not just a class you take, it's something that you can take with you for the rest of your life. And it's really helpful and everything we learned was helpful. Every single day was helpful. There was people from all over the country. You know, you made a lot of new friends and you learned what was going on in other states and you learned how they were helping their situation. And then you can use that to help your own situation. Great, Jessica, what did you learn at the conference? Um, I learned a lot through the medicine safety training program that we had at Atlanta. And I really liked it because we learned how to talk to youths, like other youths and really teach them what we know, what we believe and what we think they should know. And uh, like one of the things we taught them was how to read a uh, drug label, mm -hmm. drug label, so they know how much they're supposed to take and how to safely take it. Awesome. And Josue, I know that you are making a difference in your school. Tell me about a program that you're working on. All right, so we're working on Life of an Athlete at Central. And we recently went out to different advisories in a pair and two and pairs of twos. Mm -hmm. And um, we went and we reached out to freshmen and we talked about um, how drugs are bad and how to avoid them. And we gave them um, separate scenarios to act out and what they would do. Mm -hmm and um, they said that it was really good and that they really liked it. And why do you think it's important to be a leader, especially when you're trying to help kids stay away from drugs? After my brother overdosed, it, it gave me something to, to want to help other people out, not to, to overdose or to do any drugs because after that, it just it, it like gave me a snap back to reality. It's like, you can't do this. You have to help out others. And my, my father is really proud of me and everybody's really proud of me and that just makes me happy. That's awesome. That is awesome. Heather, why do you think it's important to be a leader as well? So there are a lot of people in this world who don't think that they can stand up for themselves or don't really think they have a voice. But when people their own age come out saying, yeah, this is a problem, and if you need help, like you can get this help, it kind of makes them feel like they can also be a leader. Jessica, why would you encourage other students? Because I know that you guys are leaders for sure, mm -hmm. but why would you encourage other students to be leaders just like you guys are? We want other people to have a voice and be able to make a stand and say what they believe. So we want to show that we're doing it and you can do it too. That was a great discussion. Back to you.